Okay, so in this video, we're going to look at how we calculate the frequency of light when given the wavelength. So, we're still using this relationship that we used when we were calculating the wavelength from the frequency. So, just remember F's for frequency, C is the velocity or speed of light in a vacuum, and the lambda is the wavelength. And the thing to remember is that the wavelength for this equation is in metres. So, if we then look at our question, uh, the data booklet shows that lithium gives a crimson flame colour with a wavelength of 671 nanometers. Calculate the frequency of this radiation. Now, because the wavelength is given in nanometers here and it needs to be in metres for the equation, we need to convert it. So you can convert it, uh, first of all, so there are a couple of ways you can do it. So you can first of all convert it by doing 671 divided by 10 to the power of 9, okay, because there's 10 to the power of 9 nanometers in a meter. Or what you can do, and it's easier to then just be able to plug it straight into the equation, is because of the laws of indices, this can then be written as 671 times 10 to the power of negative 9. Okay, because when you move the 10 to the power of 9 to the top of the fraction, it, the power becomes a negative. So what we're going to, I'm going to do it this way where I'm just going to take the wavelength that's given in nanometers and stick times 10 to the minus 9 after it. Okay, so F equals C over lambda. So C, the speed of light in a vacuum is given to you at the back page of the data booklet. So that's 3.00 times 10 to the power of 8. And that's divided by the wavelength, which we're given as 671 that's in nanometers, so to put it to meters, I need to do times 10 to the negative 9. Okay, so then I plug that into my calculator. And you will get a really big scientific notation number here. So this comes out as 4.47 times 10 to the power of 14. Okay, and the units for frequency are hertz. So that's the frequency of the light that's emitted when you burn lithium. All right.